Hey, what's up everybody? Fade here and welcome back to a new video. Today we'll be reacting to uh, the KSI versus Face Temper fight. I ended up finding this uh, 8 minute video on the fight. It says KSI versus Face Temper full boxing fight. Uh, I think the reason why it's an 8 minute video is that I, it looks like it'll show both the fighters entrances. And then I did see a tweet on Twitter saying that... Uh, KSI knocked out Phase Temper in the first round. So if it's only a one round fight, then uh, yeah, this video is not going to be too long anyways. So let, let's get into the, uh, the clip, shall we? I'm actually going to, uh, I'm probably going to mute this part or at least, I'm actually going to just lower the volume just in case copyright hits me. Because I don't want to get copyrighted for any of the music. I think was that Deji? That's not what I meant to do. Okay, was that Deji? Is that Deji right here? I think that's Deji. <laughs> the hell? Is that just a really long like robe that he's wearing or something? Is he gonna skip this part? Or, cause as much as I respect America, I don't really wanna watch. <laughs> this is an interesting way to skip it. We didn't get to hear the, are you ready to rumble? I guess this is a, this is. I'm assuming this is the national anthem, anthem for the UK. Are we going to hear the Are You Ready to Rumble? Uh-huh. That's up. That's what's up. Four? Hold on, did he say four rounds? Four? Huh. Those some thick ass uh, braids right there that uh, my boy JJ got. Uh huh. Hold on, what the fuck? What the hell? I'm assuming that's his uh, mouthpiece, but what the hell? Are those supposed to be his teeth, or is that just, just a design on the uh, mouthpiece? That looks weird as hell. Looks like he's got those, uh... Fuck, what are those teeth? Like, you know those creatures? Ah, fuck, I forgot what they what they were from. Like, I remember these, like, weird-looking creatures. And they had those teeth, but it was all around their mouth. Like, all around their mouth, and then on the inside it had those nasty-ass, like, teeth looking like that. That, that's what it reminded me of. I think they're like bluish, purplish creatures. They're just, they are nasty creatures, and that's what it reminded me of seeing that shit. I don't know what Temper was thinking wearing that. What are those tattoos on his neck, too? Damn. I hope the fight itself doesn't get skipped on any part. Uh huh. We he said it. He said it. He said it. He said, "Are you ready to rumble?" All right. We about to see the fight. Why is it panning out to the audience? That is a lot of people, to be fair. But Jesus. Yeah, that makes sense. KSI is... I wouldn't say KSI is the underdog in this fight.
damn, he weighs less than I do, and I'm 16. Oh, wow. Wait, did he say... Wait, did he say... Did he say CEO? God damn it. He's the owner and CEO of FaZe Clan? Okay. That was an interesting announcement. Uh huh. Wait, is it a boxing rule for like professional fights? Are they supposed to be the exact same weight? Because they're both 175. That's that's in, that's weird. That's actually kind of weird because, like, I'm pretty sure when uh, JJ did the two fights one night thing against Swarms and uh, Pineda, he was like 180. So he, I don't know if he ha was forced to cut down to 175 for this fight because of Faye's temper or what, but who knows, man. Let's just continue this. Without a loss, three victories. Hold on. Now let's let's think about this. He actually has four wins, but because his win against Joe Weller wasn't on like the zone or misfits or anything like that, it's not on his like official record. So like uh they didn't start uh doing the zone fights for YouTube boxing fights until like Around the time that Logan and JJ had their first fight for their first boxing match, that was around the time when they started using the zone. That's why the the draw between Logan and JJ is on his record, but the Joe Weller win isn't. Because they didn't do it when Joe Weller was fighting this guy, but they did start doing it when Logan started fighting. Is uh, another thing is, what's that guy's name? True Jordy, is he, is he uh, one of the play-by-play -play guys on this one? Why do they say actor though? Like, yeah, he's acted in like a movie or two, but like, he's not really much of an actor. He hasn't acted in years. The only movie I can think of that he acted in was a was a movie called Late in America, where him and Casper Lee were basically in America for like two weeks or whatever and they ended up trying to uh, lose their virginity before they go to go back to the UK and they ended up doing it but the writing was just kind of shit especially on KSI's end because that was back when KSI was like a, a, cring a cringy kid but yeah a mark on my leg that my that my setup is causing me. I think it's the the thing that my computer's on. So yeah. hopefully I'll be able to move that when this video is over. He's bowing. <laughs> Doing push-ups in the beginning of the round. I mean, when he was... I don't remember if he was doing push-ups during... I don't remember if he was... He was doing push-ups in the middle of the round when he did his two fights one night thing. I just don't remember if he was doing it during his Swarms fight or his Pineda fight. I think it might have been his Pineda fight, because although Swarms didn't last too long, at the same time, Swarms didn't complain every time he got hit. Pineda got 
complained about how he got hit in the back of the head every time he fucking got hit. He would hit his knee and do this shit, saying he got hit in the back of the head. Well, if you duck like this as someone's in the middle of, like, punching you, of course you're going to get hit in the back of the head. You don't just hit one knee and start complaining about how you got hit in the back of the head. That's not how it works. Wait, is he already... Wait, has it already happened? I'm so confused. It says boxing full fight. Oh, damn. Did he skip the fight and then claim that it was a full fucking fight? See the way that he looked at KSI when that happened? <laughs> Jesus. It's not over yet. Did he release a remix to this song? In my head. I was telling myself that it's not over yet. Jesus. What is this? Okay, I'm not watching this. I'm gonna actually see if there's an actual video of the full fight. It happened... Well, as of you guys watching this video, it happened yesterday. Weigh-in live stream. What about this? Does this show the fucking fight? This one's 11 and a half minutes. I'm gonna skip the intro, though. Because that video really just said Face Temple versus KSI full fight and then skips the full fight. Like, that's if that's not clickbait, I don't know what is. That video better have a lot of fucking dislikes because holy shit. Is it about to start? Oh, he's about, he's just announcing the fighters. Sorry about that first video, guys. I should have looked into it more. Before starting this video. <clears throat> We've already heard this intro. So I'm just skipping through it. Here we go. Damn. JJ looks ready. Look at the way his neck is just. Bent like that. Could not do that with my neck. We've, we've already seen the knockout. But I want to see how the fight did. Like how long this man lasted. Because obviously it's not going to go all the way to the end of the video. There's obviously going to be some bit where some bits where they're talking. That's how these full fight videos last. Well, that's how they are. Oh shit! Oh, okay. Looks like Temper's the first one to land a punch. Didn't do much though. Damn. Damn. Wait, who's taller? I think it said that JJ's like six foot one and that uh Temper's like six foot four. JJ's ready. You see the way he's jumping? Oh shit. 
Damn. This is this is a good fight so far. This is one that looks like it's worth the money. If only it didn't. Oh damn! <sighs> he keeps fucking clinching though. I think that's what it's called. Clen clinging, clinching. I don't remember what those are called. I don't know why Temper keeps doing that. I think he knows that he's gonna get fucked up easily if that doesn't happen. Damn. I don't know why he keeps doing that. The hell kind of a swing was that, though? Come on, man. Temper. It's almost like that loss, a loss against Slim ended up fucking him up. Why does he keep clenching like that? Come on. That, that looks like a weak-ass form Temper's doing. I'm not even going to lie. We didn't even get to see Temper in that. I think they're going to show a replay afterwards, but like we didn't even get to see Temper when he got knocked out. Or at least knocked down. Oh, damn. It looks like he tried to get up, but then he just fell over. So I guess, yeah, that makes sense as to why he's losing. Jeez. Okay, there's Mini Mentor, Randolph, and uh, Calafrizi. I think that was Calix behind them as well. Can we see the replay of it so we can actually see uh, Temper's face? I mean, I know we've already seen the replay in the other video, but still. Yeah, the push-ups. Damn, he must be pissed about loot knocking him out first round. I mean, even Swarms lasted a full round. I mean, yeah, he was running for the last bit of it, but still. At least Swarms lasted a full round. The fact that Swarms lasted a full round and Temper didn't either means that KSI has improved massively since the Swarms fight, or Temper is just that bad. Because I know that after... Because I'm pretty sure the same card that, phase, that Temper fought uh, Slim was also the same card that JJ fought Swarms and Pineda. So, it was on the same card, because I'm pretty sure Temper was meant to fight Blueface, I'm pretty sure. Then Blueface pulled out. I don't know why. He's kind of a massive L for that shit. Which is kind of why I thought it was funny to, uh, whenever I saw that Kai Sinat Blueface string. And... No, the thing that pissed me off about that whole situation was really just the uh, the way that Krishan Rock, Blueface's girlfriend, I don't know if they're still together, but Krishan was Blueface's girlfriend at that time. She fucking threw a chair into Kai's wall and busted a hole in it. Which is like, it wasn't too bad of a hole, and Kai wasn't like pissed off about it. But it was more of the way that Krishan reacted to it that pissed me off. Because she was just like, like Kai look, looked at the hole and was just like, you bust the hole in my wall. And then she goes, oh, you're rich, you can fix it. It's like, I know you're drunk, but that is not the way you need to react whenever you damage someone else's property. If you had at least offered, if you or Blueface had at least offered to pay to fix it, then I'm sure it would have been fine whether you actually had to pay for it or if you had just offered and then Kai was just like, oh, it, it's fine. I don't care. I'll, I'll pay for it. Like, if that if that happened, it would have been fine. But the fact that she... That Blueface didn't say anything. And then Krishan 
says that, what she said. That's what really pissed me off about that situation. But we're getting off topic from the video. So, uh, yeah, let's let's continue this. Yeah, but back to what I was saying. Blueface pulled out like a couple weeks before fight night for that card. So Slim was like a last minute uh, backup choice. So that's why Temper and Slim ended up fighting. And I'm pretty sure Faye, uh, Slim ended up knocking out Temper as well. I don't remember what round, but I'm pretty sure Slim also ended up beating Temper due to a knockout. So that was interesting. Even though a lot of people were saying that Temper was going to knock out Slim. It ended up being the other way around. Which either means that Slim has become a really good fighter, or that Temper has fallen off as a fighter. Because uh, Temper has done the worst against KSI as well. Like, Logan lasted throughout the entire fight of his time. Like, Drew against him in the first round. In the first fight and then like I guess only one like JJ only won to Logan due to a split decision so yeah JJ has gone through a lot of improvements and it has been a long time since that uh, Logan fight because I'm pretty sure the second fight happened in 2019 it's now 2023 so yeah there's been quite a few years since that Logan fight even the second one the second one was in 2019. The first one was in 2018. So if you look at, like, yeah, Logan lasted the whole time, but JJ also was nowhere near the level he is now. To be fair, I don't think Logan was near the level he is now either, but at the same time, he's only had one other fight after JJ, and that was against Floyd Mayweather, which was crazy. Pretty sure he lasted a whole 12 rounds with the guy, which is kind of crazy. I haven't seen that, that fight yet. So I might end up actually looking that up and doing a reaction video on it too. Because I haven't actually seen it. I feel like making content out of my reactions is actually great. And sorry about all these reaction videos guys. But hopefully you guys like these reaction videos. I'm only doing them because I'm kind of just trying to hold off on the gaming videos. Slime Ranchers starting to get a little boring for me. And I don't really want to finish the FNAF series off too quick. And also Night 4 is going to be scary when I start doing that but yeah hopefully you guys like these videos we've seen this what was that sound Damn! Damn! Damn, man! Bam! Ba Bam! That's that's literally what he hit temper with. <laughs> Damn! Brother did like three different bounces before hitting the ground. Bounced on the ropes. Bounced like another time right in between. Like the rope from the ground and then hit the ground. Like fucking hell. I think I think the only reason why they counted it as a knockout is because he tried getting back up and before getting back up he slipped and like fell back on the ground. And I think that if that end up ends up happening then they just call it. Because if that's what is going on already, if he's already struggling to stand back up even if he does manage to stand back up, he's probably not going to last much longer in the fight anyways. And they might as well just call it before they do some serious damage against their opponents anyways. So they, like, that's probably why they called it, up, called it so quick. But still, KSI getting this win is a massive W. I'm pretty sure that he ended up calling out Jake Paul as well. Because I'm pretty sure I saw something about that. He ended up calling out Jake Paul after this fight happened. And that fight with Jake Paul, I'm pretty sure is scheduled to be at the end of 2023. So that'll be a that'll be a fun fight to watch. Yeah, and even if even if uh, Temper didn't fall back down, he was able to get back up. It was inevitable that he was going to get knocked back down. There was no chance in hell he was going to be able to survive that.
I hope this music in the background doesn't get me copyrighted. This video, hell, this fucking fight might get me copyrighted. Oh. We about to see the knockout time again? Dang, oh, we get, what is this? Do we get to see a repeat of the fight? I think we're seeing the repeat. Hold on, let me see if this is... I think this is a full replay of the fight. There's the knockout. Yep, that, it's just a replay. Okay. So that was the uh, the KSI versus Phase Temper fight and my reaction to it. Sorry about that first clip that I showed you guys. I It said it was the full fight, and I thought it was going to be, but it ended up just skipping the full fight and showing what happened before and after, which was bullshit. So I ended up finding the right clip for you guys. So I hope you guys appreciate that. Um, and I'm going to end the video off here. So if you if you like what you saw, please leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss an upload. If you want to check out my other socials, you can go to the about, the about section of this channel. Along with the uh, description of this video and all my other videos. And with that all being said, my name is Fate. This has been my reaction to the KSI vs. Face Temper fight. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.